Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today marks August 1st, so for those of you who love fall and Halloween as much as I do, this unofficially marks the first day of <laughs> being able to decorate and get everything for fall and Halloween. Um, I know some people might disagree with that, but it's okay. My fall people will know. <clears throat> So today, I'm not decorating for fall yet, but I am getting ready for fall. So I'm going to take you guys with me and do a little fall haul. Um, and I'm going to go to some places I've never been before, and then some of my stomping grounds like TJ Maxx and all that, just to see what kind of fall decorations and Halloween decorations we can find. And then at the end of the video, I'll do a whole haul of everything that I got. All right, let's go. Let's head on out. Okay, I just got my eyebrows done. That's why I'm super red. It's also 95 degrees outside. <laughs> it's also why I'm sweating, but we're still going fall shopping. Um, I'm gonna go get some Dunkin'. I literally, like, so I am not a coffee drinker. If you know me, I don't really drink coffee. However, I feel like there's something nostalgic about an iced coffee when you're doing fall shopping. So I'm going to go get that and then I'm going to go get some fall decorations. <laughs> so let's go. Yeah. Hi, can I have a caramel iced coffee with cream and sugar? A Thank medium, you. please? Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so while I'm waiting in the drive-thru, I figured I'd kind of run you guys through what my plan is for today. So I'm gonna go to Kirkland's. We don't have one near us, like in upstate New York, but since I moved down here, I've seen so many Kirkland's and I always heard it's a great like discount store for fall stuff. So I'm very excited. Um, I'm gonna go there first, see if I can find anything cute. And then, I don't know, kind of look around, go to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and then I'll find some other places as well. All right, guys. First sip. Mm. That's actually really good. Oh, that was actually really good. Okay. First stop, Kirkland's, 
huge success. I am obsessed with that store. So that's the first time I've ever been there, like I was saying. And it's so cute in there. They have so many cute fall um, decorations and everything. And and um, it's a little bit pricier than I expected. However, they give you so many discounts. Like it was 40 bucks before all the discounts, like at the register. And then she was scanning away all these barcodes and at the end it was $24. I was like, okay, cool. So it actually doesn't, the price is not what you actually pay, which is nice. Um, so it really is comparable to like a TJ Maxx and a Marshalls, but the quality looks honestly a lot better. I'll show you when we get home and I'm just so excited to show you guys. I love the store. Next, we're gonna head to, I think TJ Maxx or Marshalls to see what they got. Okay, next stop, we are here at Marshalls and Home Goods. I haven't been to this one specifically, so let's hope we can find something good. done with TJ Maxx. This is our haul so far. That is a lot for me. I do not like spending money. Um, however, I do like returning things because then the money like goes back into your account and it feels like you're getting paid. <laughs> Don't judge my delusion, um, but I'm going to show you everything I got. We're going to try some things out. Might have to return some things. Who knows? But I have one more place we're going to stop before I give you the whole big haul. Um, this place is definitely pricey, but I have a gift card and I figured if I have the gift card, might as well fin spend it on fall or Christmas stuff because those are my favorite seasons um, and holidays. So yeah, we're going to go to, to Terrain. So if you're in the Pennsylvania area, you know Terrain, you know Terrain is expensive, but we're going to go. So here we go.
All right, everybody. Let's get to the fall haul. I know you guys are all waiting for it. So before I get into it, this might not all be like your personal style. Mine is very like neutral colors. I like for things to have like little spooky or fall like decorations on them, but I don't like when it says the words. Like I don't like tacky things. And if it's like one thing that says like happy Halloween or something maybe, but I'm not one of those like live, laugh, love people all over the walls. So everything here is kind of like toned down and neutral for my personal liking. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna read you guys the pricing of everything and where I got it from. And then let's just jump right into it. I'm gonna go most expensive first because <sighs> I had to tell you guys a story. So I got this from Terrain. Terrain, like I said, is expensive. I have two gift cards, two, to Terrain. Guess who didn't use a gift card? Me. So <sighs> guys, this looks like a lot too that I'm gonna get into. I promise I am not a shopper. I am a hoarder. Let me start that over. Not a hoarder <laughs> as in like stuff but gift cards i'm a gift card hoarder so a lot of the stuff here that i got even though there might be like a price tag on it and everything a lot of it i got with my gift cards terrain was supposed to be something out in my gift cards but as i was inserting the chip when i was checking out i was like oh my gift cards in my other hand why didn't i use that but then it's like that awkward moment you don't want to be like, I don't know, I wasn't comfortable being like, wait, can we like cancel that and do another one? So what I think I'm gonna do is have my boyfriend return it or I'm gonna return it and then I'm gonna have Andrew go and grab it on his own with the gift cards. <laughs> because I'm not spending this money. Wait until you hear the prices of, of terrain specifically. Everything else I feel like is very like, what's the word I'm looking for? It's not cheap, but it's affordable. Terrain is not affordable, okay? Without a gift card. And I didn't use a gift card. So when I saw this charge go on my card, I was like, no. I'm gonna have to return it all. I only got three things. Three things. Guess how much I paid? Oh my gosh, this is embarrassing. $127. Okay. And let me just get into it. First things first. I remember this. I got these cute little candles from Terrain. I got two sets of them, and I think I'm gonna return them both and not get them again. <laughs> I mean, take them out of the package yet because I want to just buy like black candles, and I'm like pretty creative as it is, and this doesn't even take like creativity. I could easily draw on those ghosts on my own. I don't know why I didn't think about it when I was staring at it, because these alone, one of these, $36. Oh my gosh. So we're gonna have to do a little return. I don't know what it was. It must have been the coffee because I don't drink coffee and maybe I was just amped up. I don't know what was going on. But I'll still show you because they're still very cute. Just can't break them because then I really gotta pay for them. They are cute though, aren't they? But like I could paint these on my own so I'm gonna get black candles and paint them. So these are going, sorry. But at least you got to see it for the haul. And you'll see them still in my apartment, but they're gonna be probably Dollar Tree candles and then my own paint, so. <laughs> these have to go back, sadly. Okay, but this one, I'm still returning because I want Andrew to use the gift card, but I think I might keep this one. This was so expensive. But, just wait. Just you wait. Look how cute. And I just, I love this like bowls. And it's a candle inside. It's called Witch's Brew. And it smells actually really good but besides that i'm thinking when the candle melts and stuff i can still use it as like a cute little decoration for fall you know like in the kitchen or something because it looks like a little pot like you know stew and this one 
All right, last like really expensive thing because now I'm embarrassing myself. $48, but like I said, I have gift cards and they will cover this, this little thing here. But I'm gonna have Andrew also return this so that I can save money. But cute though, right? Isn't it? Ta -da! Okay, let's move on to the actual like affordable stuff. Okay, next we have TJ Maxx. Let me make sure I got everything. Yeah, yeah. All right. TJ Maxx. Okay. All right, here we go. First things from TJ Maxx are little like home decorations. So I just thought this was so cute. This was, how do I even know what? One, two, na, 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 na. Okay, this, oh my gosh, I'm stupid, it's right there. Okay, this, $12.99. We have a lot of um, kind of like black and gold in our apartment, so I thought this would kind of tie in nicely. Let's take it out, and I'll show you what it really looks like. Yeah, so these are cute. They're like little, they're nice and like glass too, but I don't think they're breakable. What are they? I don't even know. I don't know, but there's four of them. I thought these would be cute little decorations, nothing too tacky or anything, but still says like, oh. All right, so that one's staying. Woo! Okay, and then next I have this decoration. Ooh, that was loud. All right. We have like an entryway table. I was thinking maybe we could put it on that. Yeah, I think that would be cute. This was a little pricey, it was $19.99. But for it not being like plastic or anything, I feel like it's reasonable. Right. <sighs> golly. Golly J. Golly, golly, golly. All right. I also have an obsession with candles, so I'm guessing that this one is a candle. Yep. Okay. This is pumpkin spice. Smells just like pumpkin spice, and this was $9.99. So on the cheaper side for their candles, I feel like. And look how big it is, and look how cute. It has little pumpkins, little fall leaves and everything. And this is also gonna go on the entryway table right on the book that we have. And once everything is decorated for Halloween, I'll do a whole nother like Halloween decoration vlog of like the actual apartment. Cause I have a lot more Halloween decorations that I've had like over time, my sister's gotten me. We also do a fall basket every year for each other cause we love fall. And actually right behind the camera, there's all of her um, stuff for her fall basket. And I'm gonna do a vlog on that. I don't wanna show it too soon because if she watches it, she'll know what she's getting in her fall basket. But this might be one of my best years yet on the fall basket stuff. So stay tuned and I'll show you that as well. All right. Yeah. Okay. Also, I wanna point out that I also look online for a lot of these things, like similarities for these things so that if I find something cheaper, I will return this and then buy the cheaper one. So I'll have like an Amazon, like I have an Amazon storefront and I'll put like a link in there for all of this stuff that I got here and I'll find very similar things with prices or anything that's even cheaper and I'll put it on there just so it's more convenient for you guys if you want any of these things that I am showing you. If your local store doesn't have it. All right, this I think I might return because this is pretty much what I bought at Terrain but, I don't know, but cheaper, kind of. It looks cheaper, right? Like, but it does have a skeleton in it. <laughs> and it's, um, it's a candle. I don't know why this going to be so long. It has a skeleton in it, like it's bathing in the bubble bath. This was $9.99 as well. But I still think this is more my style. Like, this is terrains, even though it's way more expensive. It's literally like $40 more. <laughs> But I have a gift card, so 
and I'm horrible at spending my gift cards, my mom would be proud of me. She would be very proud of me for knowing that I'm spending my gift cards. So this is Terrain's, this is TJ Maxx. But this is still more my style. Like just look at the texture of it and everything. And then this one's like, I mean still very cute and everything, but this one matches me more. So this one has to go. Bye bye. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. We're still working on one last thing from TJ Maxx. We got. Do, 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 do. We'll have to see how this looks. I got like a little mat for the kitchen. It's a spider web. Isn't that cute? Yeah, I don't know. We'll have to see. I might put it in. I don't know. We'll have to see. I don't know if this is a keep or a go yet, but um, this was $24.99. But I really like it and it's soft and everything, so it has to be nice on my bare feet. My bare feetsies. All right. So that was TJ Maxx. <sighs> um, and then we're gonna get into Marshalls and then Kirkland's and we're just about done, but still, there's a good amount in here, so stay tuned. Okay, now Marshalls. Like I said, I'm addicted to candles. I'm also addicted to blankets, especially fall and Halloween blankets. So I got this. <laughs> I already have one similar to this too, but it's like rainbowy kind of. I'll show you that around fall time. But they have little ghosts on them. They're so soft and fuzzy. And I don't know, I just thought it was really cute. Like I said, I'm a very like neutral girly, as you can tell. My couch is white, the walls are like gray, the photo frames are gray. Like everything is pretty neutral-ish. It's more like earthy tones. I like like the greens and the grays and the blacks and the browns. Like I like the earth look. Um, so this just really matches my aesthetic. <laughs> um, this was $24.99. I'm not sure if I said that yet, but. Okay, and then also Marshalls is this. <laughs> I'm not usually one to get things like these, but I was like playing around with it and I was like, wait, that's actually really cute. And I have like a vision for where it will go. And once I saw it in my head, I was like, yeah, I think I'm gonna get it. And it lights up, isn't that cute? So at nighttime, it'd be super cute. Yeah, this was, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, $12.99. So, it's plastic, I think, well not plastic, but I don't know what the material is. But it's definitely not glass. So, yeah. But it's cute. I like this little guy. All right, I guess now that I look at it, I'm getting a lot more Halloween stuff than I am fall, <laughs> but oh well, that's just how I am. Okay, and then last thing from Marshalls, I'm actually so excited about this. This might be one of my favorite finds out of the whole haul. And this was $14.99. Look, it's a little cutting board that is a ghost. And it has little like feetsies on the back so it stays off the ground of like the counter. And I don't know, I just thought this was adorable. And it's really heavy duty, like this is, it says marble, so, and it feels like, this is a natural stone product from India. So yeah, isn't this so cute though? The little ghost. There was a couple different ones too. Um, but this one looked happy and like smiley. So I don't know. Again, kind of like my aesthetic. <laughs> All right. Wait, we have one more thing from Marshalls. Two more things from Marshalls. Okay, then we got kitchen towels. Like I said, I'm not like a Happy Halloween kind of girl, but like if you look closely, there are little spiders all over. So it's like subtle, but still spooky. And then 
This center one is just like plain, but still kind of gives off those colors and everything. And then the last one is also the spiders again. So I thought that was really cute. And this was $9.99 for a pack of three. So pretty good deal. And then the last thing I got is we currently have placemats right now. They're very um, like basic and neutral. <laughs> That's like my word here is neutral, but they are. So I got placemats for fall, but I guess they're Halloween, <laughs> but they're a set of four like we have now and they're all different, which I thought was kind of fun. It kind of adds some color and stuff. So we have the pumpkin, a ghost, a mummy, and then a cat. So a set of four. And this was $12.99. Yeah, I thought it was cute. I don't know, adds a little bit of personality. And then, is that it? Yeah. Okay, next and finally, this will be the end of the haul because man that put a dent in my gift cards is Kirkland. I only got three things from here, but I love the store. It was so cute. I honestly might go back and just walk around more. <laughs> um, but it was a little pricey at first when you look at like the actual price of everything. But like I was explaining in the car, once they put all the um, percentages together, it's actually really cheap. So here's the first thing I got. Let me bring both of them out because then I could show you them together. They, you have to buy them separately, but they, they go together, you'll see. These, they're little candle holders. Um, and we have a bunch of candles around here, so there's this one that's like stacked with another one, which I like that like off-centered look, you know? Um, like I would probably place it like that. And then we have this little one. So this little one was $7.99, which I can get out the, with the discount, it was, wait. Oh, with the discount, it was $6.39. And then this one is normally $9.99. I got this one for $7.99. So $2 off on that one. So I thought that was super cute. And then this next one, I got $4 off. <laughs> um, and this is gonna go outside on our entryway. It says, happy haunting. Isn't that adorable? I am obsessed. I love this. This was $16.99 and I got it for $12.99. Wait, does that make sense? 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah, $4. So that was my entire haul. It felt like a lot more when I was shopping for it, but I hope you enjoyed it. And like I said, check out my storefront. That's gonna have everything that I can find that's very similar to these products or the exact products, um, possibly even cheaper products than what I found today. I will be looking. And then stay tuned because my next couple of vlogs from now, I'm going to be doing what I got my sister for her fall basket. And that one you definitely don't wanna miss. That one is so good and it's always so personal and it's like, it's very custom made. It looks very cute. So. Stay tuned for that and thanks for joining me today. Bye.